This institution is now Klingdur University, Klimastal Klingdur. It is a great day for everyone in this town and region of Wales, hitherto missing having a university, but it's also a great day for Wales. Every university, to be truly effective, must reach out beyond its home region. And I'm sure that Wrexham will be conscious of the need to recruit students from all over the UK and indeed the world. And that will enrich the student experience for those who are here. It will also enrich the town and the region uh, of Wrexham and North East Wales. And I hope that people will realise that the chances of getting a really good degree that's going to entitle you to very good life chances and employment opportunities after getting your degree here will be excellent. And one of the reasons for that is the very strong, and I hope in future even stronger, connections between this university and the local employer, business and the public sector. It is now my pleasure, formally to summon the first congregation of Glyndur University Rexham in order to confer upon the First Minister for Wales, the Right Honourable Roger Morgan, an honorary fellowship of the University in recognition of his continued support for the institution and now the University over the past seven years. I think it's been one of the most enjoyable days of my eight and a half year career, if you can call it a career, as First Minister. Because sometimes there's some very tough aspects of this job and sometimes there's some very pleasurable aspects. And to see um, the culmination of years of really hard work by Professor Mike Scott, the Vice-Chancellor, and the academic team and the student body here, reaching this day where it becomes transformed from a below university institution to a full degree awarding university institution is great for the area, it's great for Mike Scott and his team, 
and it was hugely enjoyable and an enormous honour for me to be part of it today. I cannot emphasise too much how much hard work that is in front of this institution that having laid the foundation stone today by ceasing to be an institute and becoming a fully fledged university in its own right it's got a terrific chance of success. We want to be bold. We've got a vision. We've got a vision to have a university for the people. We've got a vision of a university which is for the economy that drives things forward. So now, uh, I think we reveal the actual branding of Glyndura University of Exam. I would like uh, to propose a toast. Glyndura University Wrexham. Today is about Newey becoming a university and changing its name uh, to Glyndura University Wrexham. That is immensely important for the town, it's immensely important for the students uh, who come to this university, it's immensely important for the, for the region um, because as a university uh, you have a role as the driver for the economy of the region. I've had a fantastic day, yeah it's been really wonderful and uh, it's been terrific with the staff and the staff have been so excited, uh, this has been the, the end of, uh, and the beginning I suppose, but the end of a, a, a campaign and now the beginning of a new, uh, a new era for this institution and at last we're a university. Uh, the way you compete of course, if you haven't got the resource to do absolutely everything that you want to do is to make sure that you've got the quality and that's what we're about. We've got real quality in teaching, in the staff, real quality in our research and also in, in the advice that we can give to business and industry. Uh, so it's not always all the glitz that, uh, that, that shows the quality, it's actually uh, the solidity of the, uh, of the product and that's what we've got here and uh, I'm very excited about that. As a new university uh, we're going to learn from the from the the great universities and uh, one day quite soon i believe we're going to be with them uh, at the top of the, at the top of the tree that's what we're after there's no point in in uh, in being anything else we want to be a top university and uh, that's that's the aim and i i think we can do that i think we've got the staff to do it i think we've got the drive to do it and we've got the vision to do it <laughs>